Oh my gosh, that's <laughs> enthusiasm. I'm not letting him start our day anymore. That was like lame. Hey, well, I didn't start it because he's been on the phone. That's fine. And I had to get going because we have a teeny It's a window. beautiful, smoky day in 2020. All the... The meteor hasn't hit yet. The plague is still rolling on, I guess. Zombies haven't come. Life there was is a, good. Stop. There was a wind that came and pushed all the California smoke and Oregon smoke northward up yeah. into Washington last night. And we have our own fires too, so it's it's yeah getting getting yeah. smoky. And the headlines this morning said that one in ten Oregonians have been evacuated from their home, which is uh, I feel for all you guys, uh, all, everybody going through the fire stuff and having to worry about evacuations. You know, prayers, thoughts go out for you guys. Um, it's gotta be rough. We we are lucky. We're going to Costco. Oh, am I supposed to get a better angle? Yeah, just like not so much boob. <laughs> just. <laughs> Just well, it's hard not. I know it's hard. So I know. Boat, it's there's hard. like hard not to get it. It's a lot um, of screen there. Anyways, uh, we're on our way to Costco because we are going to do a special Costco haul. What is it? Well, PG and E or P and E? What is it? Okay, this is why I do things. No, you're driving. Talk I, to me. We're doing. It's the Costco is doing the P and G sale. Oh yeah. Which most people don't even like think about like. Looking at the little coupon book, where did it go? I don't see it. It's a coupon book. You've seen it before. Right. We'll, we'll insert a little picture of it. Okay. So the idea is that you stock up on $100 of P&G products, and you get a $25 gift card. And I will, I will do anything well, to save a bump. Bumpy. You got to keep the road. I'm around. not doing anything <laughs> different. I know. I'm just complaining to you like you do to me. Because you drive bad. I don't you drive, drive bad. bad. It's called bumps in the road. You drive like a race car down a 25 mile an hour. I don't hill. drive by a race car. It's called bumps, and you're like, oh. Can you focus what you're doing? Because oh, it looks I really am. bad. What, what's bad about it? <laughs> okay. If you want to see if a Costco stop, haul. If you stop jiggling the car. If you want to see a Costco haul, stay. You maybe you have already seen it. I don't know what if I'm going to put these up in what order. But that's what we're going to go do. So you can't see the Costco stuff in the this video. Creeping in our lane there. I know. So I'm going slow. But uh, anyway, and then we just have a small window with the kids in school and Abby didn't have a call for an hour. So I left her in charge of Ashley um, to get some homework done. And then Ashley's teacher is actually sick today. So she has Chelsea's old teacher filling in on Zoom calls. <laughs> so it's kind of a weird day for Ashley's schooling. But then we kind of just need to, and then I'm donating blood later this afternoon. Um, when do I find out about whether my blood test results? Are I think they said within a week or two you'll get your antibody results oh, okay. in your email. Oh, I gotta check email. Yeah. So that is what we're doing so far. Exciting. But I don't know if I'm gonna let the kids play outside. I don't know what it's they're gonna do. It's pretty smoky. I'm not sure. I feel bad for the kids. I feel it in my like mouth already, and I'm just yeah. sitting in a car. It's like better to wear a mask. Like it's actually literally better to breathe through the mask. No, but I don't want to make them do that outside. Oh, I don't, no, they're I don't, kids. I don't make them do that. We'll just pretend they start smoking. It'll be okay. <laughs> Cut. Done. <laughs> it's pretty empty. Where can I go? Well, there? we could go there and reach around, but some old guy might yell at us. Oh my goodness, Jason. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're done at Costco. Did we make our mark? Did we get to the hundred dollar mark with the P and G? I don't know if I told you guys, this is what we're doing in our Costco haul. Did we get to the $100 mark on all the stuff we got for that sale? Go find our Costco video. I don't know if it's already gone up yet. I think it has. I'll put it up here if it has. Go find out if we got our $25 gift card from Costco just by shopping. Go find out. And I'm going to go get a cold beverage and then we're going to go home, right? We don't have any more errands? Uh, there's a coupon for medium fries. Ooh, free fry Friday? Smart man. Let's Whoa. go get him. Gotta pull it up now. There's no Wi Fi. It's really annoying. There's no, I can't connect to McDonald's Wi Fi. You're not close enough when you're in your car. And there's no network in their entire parking lot. <laughs> so you can't Wait, pull up the app. If you pick up or something or drop off curbside. Okay, we'll help Jason with the app in just a minute. His isn't as good because he doesn't use it often. Mine has yeah. better deals. <laughs> you're, you're a preferred customer for I'm sure. I'm a preferred McDonald's customer. You're like double platinum. <laughs> French fry or Dude, something. Dude, I wish. I get free fries all the time. So, we're gonna go figure out that, but I have to like pull up the coupon on my phone before we pull into the parking lot. So I'll be right back. 
All right, so we will pull up a deal just in time to pull into the <laughs> drive through here. And don't worry, you can't use this again. It actually expires in about, I don't know, 90 seconds or so. So you gotta hurry and uh, get it up on your phone and then hurry and order before this code changes. <laughs> a little tricky. I've actually had to pull out of the parking lot, go across the street to Hobby Lobby and get the network to pull up the app and then get my discount. Cause I'll do anything to get a dis discount, clearly. I haven't checked in with the kids yet. I'm assuming all their Alexa alarms are working. They're working for when they're home. And I just ordered the girls some watches. Let's see if I can show you what I ordered. I got them some watches because they're just not coming home from the park without prompting. So I just ordered these watches. They're coming today. Chelsea got a blue one and then Ashley got a white one and it'll let me set one alarm on it. Totally old school, you guys, but I need my kids to just not have fancy Apple watches at the age of 10 and seven, so. So when I was showing Chelsea these watches and asking her to pick out which one she wanted, I have a, had a couple different styles in my little shopping cart for Amazon, and she's like, well, how about a Fitbit? And I was like, girl, you're 10. You don't need a Fitbit. You already run around till you're ragged and black feet, like, you don't need a Fitbit. I know you get enough exercise for the day. I don't need to know how much you do. Anyway, her friends all have Apple Watches and Fitbits and... It's ridiculous. It's ridiculous. And I'm trying to make sure that they still are responsible. But, like, they're still kids. Let them, let them yeah, be kids. Yeah, can I have a... Jason still has drive through anxiety, just so everyone knows. <laughs> all right, we just got home from Costco. Here's a little sneak peek at what we got. But I'm going to put my little tap pack. I don't know if you guys ever want to like discreetly store your feminine products. I have a cute little box that sits down on the floor in my bathroom. And then I just pile them up. The girls like these little ones because they fit in their pockets and they're more discreet. So just stock this little box back up. And then I have one upstairs in my bathroom as well. All right, so I'm putting like a third of the box into my bucket here. I'm going to just slide it back there. And I'm going to stick this in my laundry bucket, along with the deodorants that we just got. And then I can put some in my bathroom and chill Kaylee and Abby's bathroom upstairs. Hey Jace, can you bring down the air purifier? Bring it to the study that's really bad in there. It's getting, the smoke is really like, can't smell it out here in like the main part of the house, but in here, it's getting really bad. So I've had to like add another towel here to kind of cover up the gaps. <sighs> I can smell it, it's starting to like give me a headache. I've got my lunch here. Got a tub of carrots to just nibble on, and an orange cottage cheese. The kids are just really doing good at school. I'm gonna do an updated, like, daily video, like, kind of from my perspective, but also to kind of show what the kids are doing, but mainly to kind of show how I'm occupying my time during their Zoom calls and, and whatnot, but I actually really, really like it. So I'm gonna, I want to, one, I wanna remember, like, this time, it's unique, and hopefully we don't ever have to do this again, but I also wanna show, you know, the, the ups and downs of doing virtual school, so we can remember it later, and so that, you know, when the kids are back in school, maybe complaining about homework, we can remember how, you know, different it was now when we're home, and, you know, in 10 years when they're all graduated, and, <laughs> You know, remember back when kind of a thing. And so I'm going to do an updated video on literally from morning till evening and kind of what our day is like now doing virtual school. So stay tuned for that. I don't know. I'll have to film that next week because today is Friday, but sometimes Mondays are harder to like be really ready for <laughs> a video like that right first thing in the morning, which is again, part of the daily routine that's changing now is that I am losing opportunities to film. We'll talk about that then. <laughs> So I'm gonna go back to working on my computer. Got a lot of videos to edit right now, three coming for you soon. And again, the kids are on the calls for another hour or so. And then I've gotta go donate blood. So as soon as they're done, I have to head out. Jason's doing a conference call with our bank. Never ends, folks, it never ends. Enjoy your nap. <laughs> no, I'm nap. I know, I'm no, kidding. Okay, no, no, I appreciate it, I appreciate it. But they have a closing meeting, Zoom call at 3.20. It, it'll tell you if you're sitting here. I have a business call. I know, so just hang on. Chelsea and Ashley, dad will be on a call when you guys need to get on a call. Okay, so you need to listen to your alert and get on your closing meeting. Chelsea, ah, uh, do you have homework? Okay, go get it done. I have to read, but you're all being loud. I'm being loud, you little snark. Go get your stuff done. If you ever wonder who lives in our house, it would be Ashley and Ashley. And Ashley, and Ashley, <laughs> <laughs> evidence that Ashley truly does live here. All over, she utilizes every space in our house. 
Is that right? Is that pirate booty already gone? Yes. Is it close? Show them. It's like halfway. <laughs> and dad was making fun that I got four bags of it. Now we know why. He's like to have two bowls. Of yeah. So, kind of a bummer. They were trying to call me, the, the blood bank was trying to call me right when I went in to the building to go donate blood. They said they cannot keep the smoke out of their building because they are getting too hot and they keep having to open the windows. And then all this smoke comes in and they said it's just not safe for everyone who's in here donating blood and for the, you know, the workers. Come on, open car. <sighs> so, I walked in and she was like, I'm so sorry. I'm like, you were just trying to call me, huh? She's like, I was. So, and I couldn't reschedule because they're booked for all their next um, appointments. So, <laughs> super big bummer because I wanted to get the antibody test. Oh well, whatever. I have some free time. Maybe I'll go to Marshall's. And I, I need to go to Target. And Jason knows I'm going to go to Target. I'm going to go to Marshall's and get a few things and then Target because I need some setting spray. My, I don't know if it's just the humidity today, but I didn't have setting spray for my makeup and it's just melting off my face. And I don't know if it's the humidity or the smoke or the heat. It's like, it's only 77, but I think it's just trapping in the humidity. It's Friday, but it doesn't feel like Friday. Normally the kids would be like rushing to get up back outside and I don't think I'm gonna let them. It's really bad out here. And I don't really wanna pay for pizza again. And there's no movies at Redbox. So it doesn't feel like pizza night, movie night, Friday night <laughs> tonight. So I've gotta figure out something different for the girls to kinda do tonight. And I gotta call Jason actually and tell them not to send them back outside. All right, so I literally can't show you half of what I got from <laughs> Marshall's because it's a gift and I don't know when I'm gonna give it to her, a friend of mine, so, or how I'm gonna be able to give it to her. So, I can show you the other two things. They're not exciting. Some mascara, some syrup. This is just vanilla. I have a question for you guys. Like we get this syrup to make like Italian sodas, but we get like berry flavors and pineapples and you know, I do get vanilla because Jason likes make like a vanilla coke or vanilla pina colada i've never done it with like chocolate or salted car caramel or pumpkin spice maybe i'm not maybe it's because i'm not a coffee drinker but like i don't know what other drinks i would put those syrups in i'm trying to think of like fall drinks i don't know like an apple cider vanilla salt i don't even know like what would you make but you need to put like some kind of the fizzy soda in it maybe and then the the cream the you know the, the milk i just they sound so good like the chocolate fudge and salted caramel i just as a non-coffee drinker i don't know what else i would put those kinds of flavors in so if you have any ideas or what drinks you do with like these syrups let me know because these are actually cheaper these are 3.99 here and they're like almost five dollars at they're actually probably five dollars 550 even at cash and carry which is where we get them on discount because regular stores have them for like eight to twelve dollars a bottle so now that i've kind of found some other ones i just need to know what other drinks i can make with them <laughs> all right so i'm gonna head to target and look for chairs for Kaylee. They did not have anything here at Marshall's. I don't think I'm gonna have any luck at Target either. All right, so I'm gonna end our night now. I feel like I have been in a campfire for the past 24 hours. <laughs> I want to take a shower and wash it all off. Jason's actually having friends come over tonight. So it's just two guy friends. They were gonna do like a barbecue tonight at one of their houses and be outside and enjoy the outdoors. One of them has a really, really nice backyard, but they can't do that now because it is just so smoky. It smells smoky now that I've turned off filter on the air conditioning. Gotta get turn that back on. So they're gonna come over here, like watch a movie, have snacks. So Jason just went back to Target to get snacks even though I was just there like an hour and a half ago. And then, they'll come over here and hang out. So I'm gonna end today's video. I don't even know what to call this video. Like just, this is a very typical day, I guess. Like the kids are doing school and we're trying to run errands and we're kind of having to tag team on who gets to leave the house. We had pizza for dinner. I grabbed that from Target. So nothing fancy. Chelsea and Ashley got their new watches. Ashley, do you like your new watch? It's kind of fun, huh? So they have an alarm set on the watch. Even on Saturday and Sunday, the alarm is to remind them to eat lunch. <laughs> 
because they sometimes forget until like three o'clock on Sunday afternoon. Oh yeah, I'm kind of hungry. So anyway, we're gonna call it a night and I'm gonna wash this humid, smoky mess off of my body. Take care you guys and we will see you next time. And remember, stay tuned because I am truly gonna do like an actual routine video. Kind of start fresh in bed and go through my day and just kind of walk through our new normal because it's way different now than it was before. Kind of have to modify. So stay tuned for that video and we'll see you guys next time.